Hello, and welcome to Earth Cannon. The boss fight, hopefully. Hopefully there's a boss here. Oh! Yeah. I'd say that's a boss. That, yeah, that's a boss. That, yep, I probably should have dumped some more points in the engine, huh? So I can get out of its way. So, knowing that it warps, maybe we can, uh... I mean, at least we don't have any big scores to lose, right? Right? <laughs> ah! Five. 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 That's someone's phone number, at least the middle three digits of it. They live in fantasy world, of course, you know, the world of Hollywood's... Oh, gosh! Oh, my gosh! All right, Red. If you can... Ah! What the... Oh! Oh, stop it. My gosh, that thing is powerful. So, uh, I read in the comments to this game, not your comments, but on the website, particlasm.com. Read some of those, or really it's lucaspaha.com for reasons unexplained. Anyway, what I read was that I'm dead! Yes, it said, it said to me that you're dead! That's what it said. You get to the last level, and you're dead. I also read something that said, Don't worry about the big murder circle. Nah, nothing. My big murder circle. Nothing to worry about. It Just sit in the middle of the map and do nothing at all. And you'll be absolutely fine. It'll just orbit around you. It'll just... It'll just say, Hello, murder. Hello. Hello. How's it? How goes it, huh? How goes it? How goes it, Ether Cannon? How? Ooh, your face. It'll just be like that. You know? I don't even know what that. I'm dead. I really don't even have a chance. Didn't have a chance. Alright, basically, the point is that. I'm dead again. Alright, the, po the point is that people were wrong and who said this game was easy to beat in the last level. They said, last level, easy, beat it first try is what they said. Yeah, yeah, I'll bet, huh? I'll bet. Yeah, just post in the comments to this video. You beat the big red murder circle first try. Yeah. How much epic slow-mo do you even need to make that happen, huh? How much? So I was playing the whole game thinking, thinking to myself, engine? I don't need engine. I'm just going to sit in the middle of the screen for the last level. I'm going to say to the big red murder circle, I'm just going to sit in the middle of the screen and chill. No problem. I'm going to be okay. And so I didn't work on getting my engine awesome. Obviously, a big mistake. Like, seriously, I'm dead! Alright, well, we're just here. Look, look, we just have to think about where it's going. We have to, we have to calculate which way it's going to warp. I'm dead! And somehow we have to hit it enough times to get it, it dead. And if we can't do that, if we can't figure out a way to kill it in a reasonable amount of time, meaning... Meaning the next few days, you know? Meaning the next few hundred episodes, I'm gonna have to play the game over from scratch and focus all my attention on the engine. So I'll be able to evade this stupid red murder circle's wrath. I mean, this is ridiculous. This red murder circle is like, seriously murderous. I mean, dude. Shield is not gonna help me here. I mean, I'm sorry, but I thought I could just, I thought it'd be, I didn't know the nature of what I'd be fighting, okay? That's the truth of it. Now, if only, if only I could use these upgrades to get my ship upgraded enough, you know? 
If only I could use these upgrades I keep getting. Alright, I'm just gonna sit here and chill. I'm just gonna sit here and I'm going to chill, alright? I'm going to do what the person in, in that stupid comment suggested. I'm just going to chill here. They said, Evil Red Death Murder Circle has no ability to chase after you. It'll just sit in orbit. It'll just sit in orbit. That's what they said, and apparently that's almost true. But I still have to move my fat ship of cannon out of the way from time to time. If I don't want to get myself murder killed every five seconds. Hmm, ten seconds. Five seconds is just used respawning my ship. My little murder death cannon ship. Ah! All right, Red. I'm just gonna sit here and do nothing. I'm gonna do what the people suggested. All right, so if you're wondering how to get out of the way of a speeding tornado, this could save your life. Let me just give you some advice here. Evil murder tornado moving towards you. What do you do? Do you, A, run away from, from it, B, put your hands over your head and try to surrender, C, start uh, digging a hole for yourself in the ground, more like digging your own grave, <laughs> or do you, D, hold on, are we on D or E, I, I forget, or do you, E, uh, Press your Staples Easy button, which you got, big surprise, from Staples. Or do you, F, start, um, well, what do you have to say? What is it? Something about State Farm is there like a good neighbor? State Farm is there to get killed by the tornado right by your side. Maybe you should have said... Like a good neighbor, State Farm is here with a weather bunker with a nuclear bomb shelter that is also protective against tornadoes. Or, or do you, uh, G, I might give you an F for that one, let's just say that, yeah? That idea, all of these actually, probably an F. Do you G, perhaps, perhaps G, you might, uh, well, your choice. Post in the comments. Your own. Pick your own death technique. Pick your own way to get killed by a tornado. How creatively can you die? Be good, and you might actually get yourself into some newspaper somewhere. All right, and, uh, what was the other... Okay. And w then what... I was actually at some point going to tell you what you should actually do according to science. Yes, the scientifically. <clears throat> scientifically. <laughs> yeah, right. Scientifically, you would. Uh, let's see, where are we on now? It, what comes after G? I forget what comes after G. Let's see. A, B, C, D. Uh, uh, E-F-G-H. Okay, so plan H for science. H is for the scientifically claimed way to avoid getting murder killed by tornado. And it is... Surprise, surprise, run, run laterally. Just run away laterally. Assuming that you can figure out which way the tornado is actually moving or in a vehicle which can move it, you know, like, move it. Also, it would help really, really a lot if there was a, uh, you know, if you weren't in a, a traffic jam, you know, otherwise you probably want to get out of your car. Basically, what I'm saying is, they're really, it's circumstantial, okay? You dig yourself a hole, you get in the bathtub, you do a lot of, you know, get in the weather shelter. There are a lot of things you could do to get out of a tornado. If you, if circumstances are proper, and in the only way that applies at all to this episode and me trying to survive this, getting hit, almost killed by this big red thing, the only thing that really applies at all is trying to run to the side of its motion. Okay. Now, 
if it, the tornado can sentiently follow your every move with the direct intention to kill you and can warp so that it, it passes you multiple times and just keep coming like a warping, time-traveling, mad uh, uh, bull, like cow, like bull cow that matadors fight, then you probably have about as much chance of surviving as most matadors in the old days had. Which is none, basically. You're dead. Just like me! Yay! Alright, let's see if I have a, any chance. Ah, oh, God! This is impossible! This is insane! I'm bloodying this thing's nose! But I died anyway. And then it goes to full, full health. I mean, I need a quick save, alright? I need to quick save every second. And I need old quick saves to be saved in case a bad quick save is saved. Alright, I, I basically, I need a win button. Okay? Uh, I need a Staples Easy button, and I need it now. And I need it to actually work. Okay? Hey, Big Murder Circle. Word is that you can't attack someone who's just sitting still. What do you think about that, huh? Crazy, huh? Impossible, huh? We'll come and get some. Oh, it's trying to get some. It got some. I don't get it. How does it even work? I mean, let's just see. We're going to sit here. It still thinks it's going to attack me. Let's see how long. Ooh, didn't take long at all for it to murder me, did it? No. No, it didn't. Look at this. Look, it, it's it's just... It's constantly... I mean, yeah. Sig in one place will protect me for... Ooh, a long time. Yeah, it takes a while for it to get back into position. But... By the time it... But it does eventually, and then... Whammo! Dead! I mean... What am I supposed to do here, huh? Am I really supposed to keep playing this? With my weak baby engines? Or am I going to play it over again? And have stronger engines? Well, I think I'm going to play it over again. And I'm going to have stronger engines. But I'm going to think on it, okay? I'm going to go and vomit. And then I'm going to come back. And I'm going to put on my thinking cap. And I'm going to figure out a way to beat this thing at any cost. Even if I have to restart the whole game from scratch? But fine. Fine, I, I'll do that. Yeah, why, why not? Not really strategy got it. Oh, something. I'll, it, it, it'll be good, okay? It'll all be good. <laughs> Alrighty then, thanks for watching. <laughs> Goodbye.